know May 24th is Red Nose Day. All right, so I'm going to take off my nose so I can actually talk. But today's topic is the three P's, people, product, and professional services. All right, we're going to talk about each one of them, but the number one thing people should think about is people. And in this case, May 24th is National Red Nose Day. It's about giving to save kids, to help kids. Ivan, why don't you pop your video up here? And hey, Ivan. Hey, man. Hey, ninjas. Hey. You can take your nose off, too. Oh, okay. and now, here's the thing, Ivan. What are the five causes that Red Nose Day cover? Well, that's a great question, Ben. Let's see. One is immunization. Very important. Yeah. Mental health. Hey, very, very important. Education. Education, of course. Domestic violence. Very, very important. And fighting malaria. So, so we have to, they have to choose which one is worth But everybody, go out there, buy a nose in, your, in, the, in, the, in the stores that have it so the money goes to Red Nose Day. Donate to it. But also, this brought me up to one other thing. When you talk about domestic violence and you talk about kids, and we're all about saving the kids, there's another cause going on, which is Rock One Sock, right? So Ivan and I, well, here's mine. Ivan, you want to go to my video? Sure. Watch. So watch this. I am rocking one sock this entire month. Why? Wow. Why am I rocking one sock? The reason I'm rocking one sock is because I am worried about missing kids. This is one of those, you don't know when someone's missing. Check out the organization. I find it incredible. The knowledge that you need to get about, you know, you know rocking one sock. This, this people are, kids are being abducted every single day. This will, you know, sheds a light on it. Um, and it's, it's pretty amazing. I mean, did you show your feet yet? I have not shown my feet, but Ben, I am rocking one sock as well. And, and as a father of two kids, Ivan. Oh my God, it makes me sick. I don't even want to talk about it. It's, it's hard. I mean, I do want to talk about it, but it, it, it hurts to talk about it. Excellent. Yeah. Show me your feet, man. Show me your I feet. I got one sock, and the yeah. other one is So Ivan and I That's are right. rocking one sock. One and guess sock. what? In New York City today, it is raining crazy. Like my one foot is going to get sopping wet. But you know what? We don't care. No. All right? That's what this is all about. So now let's bring you to the three Ps. All right, so the three Ps. I'm going to start in, in, in kind of different order, but here's what I, Ivan, I'm really a big believer of this, right? What's that, babe? And this is a ninja. I know this is all about digital media and it's about delivering it, and that's what this is sort of about, too. Um, Ivan and I had the privilege of, of seeing um, Marcus Leonis, um, who basically is a prophet on CNBC, Amazing. speak. Right? And he's like the king of small businesses. Businesses, right? He saves them and makes them better and invests in businesses. And, you know, one of the, the two things that I walked away from his, his conversation was about people, right? And that's one of the P's, right? Everyone, a lot of bosses go, I'm going to get the cheapest employees. I'm going to do this. This is how we're going to make more money. And he, most of those companies, they fail. No one wants the, the cheapest. Yeah. You want the best employees. The you best. need to invest in your mm -hmm. employees. Your people is probably the most important thing in your company. Now, let's, let's give this a given. You better have a good product, and we're going to talk about product is number two. And you better be able to service that product and give your clients what you want. But if you don't have really good people in your organization, I guarantee you, eight out of ten times your company will fail. I mean, how important do you think it is putting together the right people and really giving, giving back to your employees? It's crucial. It's op if you want to have an optimal company, you need the right people. That's yep. bottom line. You know, I, I, built, I built a company and I, and, I, and I sold a company. And one of the things that I learned from it is I never would have been able to sell my company if it wasn't for the 60-plus employees who worked for us at the time who all believed in what we were doing, but they all believed in it because we made our company all about our employees. First, now, obviously, employees. we want to have the best product and yes. we cared about our customer. Right, it's it always about the customer. I've and I've even done a presentation for digital media on customer, customer, customer. But guess what? If you don't have the right people, your customers won't be happy. You agree, I, Ivan? I do agree. And you know what, Ben? If you don't have the right people, you're not going to have the right product if they're developing it. Right. Yeah. So that so, goes to P number two. Yeah. Product, product, product. And if you're in a digital media world, if you're going to deliver videos, whether it's to Facebook or YouTube or your own private platform, or if you're going to build an ECDN for a client, or you're going to build a database or a digital asset management system, you better have really good product, right? Product, product, product. None of this hype stuff. Have really, really good product. And then the key to all of this, right? Now you have the best people on your team. You have a really good product, professional services. I mean, how important do you think it is? Uh, professional services, Ben. You need to you need to be uh, to be servicing the client. Well, but yeah, but you need to see. Here's what people forget about enterprise, because you know, digital media ninjas is really about the enterprise, whether it's behind the firewall, external. But one of the keys to it, all this is um, no one is network, no one's infrastructure, no one's company was really built to deliver digital media. 
to deliver video. And what we really believe in is you can't just give the company tools. You have to offer professional um, services, Absolutely. white glove services, combination of white glove services. Um, you can do it on your own. We can do it with you. We can do it all. We can bring in cameras. We can bring in production. We can bring in editing. We can bring in encoding. You can do it. We can bring in design. But the <coughs> bottom line is just because you build it and they come, right? doesn't mean they're going to use it the right way. They need your help. So my advice to every one of you ninjas out there, professional services, customer service, event services, meeting exactly. services, product services, service the heck out of your clients. If you're, if you're a good leader and you put together the right employees, the right team, the right people, they will be able to service a client. And if you give them the knowledge and the respect to how important your customers are to keep your business going, the sky's the limit. And then also, right. have really good product. Yeah. Ivan, anything you want to add? Absolutely. Not only show them how to use your product, but make sure that you're using your product optimally on site or wherever you are. If you're not, if you don't show them how or you're not doing that professionally, personally, then maybe the maybe it won't be the best product to the client because they're using it incorrectly. And then, Professional services. And then the last thing, going back to the very beginning, um, especially on Red Nose uh, May 24th and Rock One Sock, and all the other great causes out there. Give back a little, all right? We all can give back, and giving back does not mean writing big checks. Giving back could be a little check, giving back giving your change. Giving back could be working in a soup kitchen for a day. Giving back could be doing anything you can do to help. We all need to be a little more charitable, and we all need to help, and I, and I promise you this, if you give to the outside, it will pay you back going forward. You know, pay it forward. The, com the, the, the topic that's saying Always. is so true, and it's never been more true in today's world, today's economy. So again, people, product, professional services, and be charitable. And guess what? It's all about the kids, right? So we, we either all have been kids. We all have moms. We all had dads. We all might have, some of us have kids. End of the day. Let's keep our kids safe. Let's keep our kids healthy. Safe. And you know, and I, with um, Rock One Sock, no kid should ever go missing. And um, That's true. let's let's end all of this. And at the same day time, let's service our clients. Ivan, why don't you take us home? I love that, Ben. I couldn't say it better than my than, <laughs> well, than you. you. Obviously, you couldn't <laughs> say it. I couldn't it. say it better than myself. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we'll see you on the next episode.